I want to talk today about using the ITTS data programs in Tableau Reader. For instance, in 2007, I released uh, Working Paper 7, Summary of Data in Integration, and you see these files on here that I provided for um, the state of Missouri. If you notice, all of these files have a W TWBX, which means it is a Tableau working book that is packaged, which means this file can be opened up in Tableau, another Tableau desktop or Tableau reader and have all the information that's there. So that was the summary of the working paper. Then we did Scott County training. This was tied to kind of the container on barge stuff. But again, the same thing. Just basically taking the dashboards and I did some integration work on it. Same tables, but it had some additional information in each of the files. So this is the executive briefing book that came out in June. And if you notice, there's a lot in here that are basically all these dashboards that I prepared. I'm just opening up, clicking up one of them as an example. And so these dashboards were created in Tableau Desktop. All the work that I did was using Tableau Desktop, which is the program to modify and change and integrate data and whatever you want to do. It's the it's the the tool that that does the data integration brings everything together. So if I open up this one program, which I just opened up for the state of Arkansas. We see kind of this dashboard great. There's a map. We'll talk about all this in just a second. State GDP, you know, the dashboards, and some information on here. So that's a, a static PDF that was created from the desktop file. So if I go to Tableau Reader, which you're, I'm assuming you're going to download, you download it here. Tableau.com products slash reader. You download it. And then... Here's some help buttons on here, such as the basic Tableau reader program. You know, what is the application window means? I'll spend some time on here. Basically, you have a file, you have a worksheet, you have dashboards, you have windows. So a lot of stuff is prepared, how to navigate through the workbook, such as going through the bottom panels, going through different um, layouts here. And, of course, the, the toolbar and the menus, the icon, undo, which is right here, which you will use a lot. The, um, you know, undo, redo buttons. This can pause running updates in case you want to do a whole bunch of design work and have it refresh every time. Auto view, and this is put you in the presentation mode. So you can actually use these Tableau Reader in a PowerPoint presentation or hook it up and, and use it as a, presentation to a monitor. Some of the useful terms, you know, cross tab, dashboards, some of the things that they think are important to know. How to open workbooks. I've already opened up all the workbooks just because of the sake of, of um, ease and time. You can also have this open up as a right mouse click if you have installed Tableau, desktop, uh, Tableau Reader. And you can have Tableau Reader and Tableau workbook on the same machine. Reverting workbooks, talking about going back to a saved version. So here's the presentation mode. If you want to use it, hook it up to a monitor or something. And then just some ideas on how to interact with various things, such as filtering data, which we will be using a lot. Um, sorting data, we'll talk about that, some of those. And then other actions that you can you can use, and then uh, the most important thing for you might be publishing to PDF, exporting to another application, or even printing the information. So Tableau Reader lets you get to a lot of this information, and you don't have to worry about doing design work. You don't have to worry about doing all of that heavy lift because it's kind of already done. So we're going to close this out. Let's look at Tableau Reader. So basically, this is what the Tableau Reader screen looks like. If you notice, the Tableau Reader is orange. Um, the traditional Tableau desktop has blue in its design. 
kind of a welcome screen. These shows you files. This shows files that have already been opened recently. 